hi guys welcome to my channel today i have a let's routine but i want to tell you some points that you had to have really clear and are really important when you're gonna go to work out at the gym one is that you have to keep in mind that you need a stretch in order to warm your muscles to prepare to do exercise because it is easy way to avoid any fracture or any lesion in the muscles that is pretty easy you get a of the gym another thing that i think is pretty important is that you had to have a routine in order to get results something important about create a routine is that you have unless do five exercises that work the muscle in what you want to focus there are different ways to work out some exercises are isolation exercises it will focus in one group of muscles and it also will use one single joint movement. These exercises are good when you want grow muscle because are exercises that are focused in particular muscles. Like for example, a squat is a component exercise. Also, good morning is a component exercise. When you work component exercises, these exercises work different group of muscles. Those exercises are high impact and it's easy that you get a lesion. You have to keep in mind that when you are planning a routine. Uh, something also important is that you have to have a short recovery time short-term recovery takes place following intense exercise the primary goal during this recovery period is to keep the body moving at less intense speeds quick recovery is important because it is essential to give your body enough time spent not training to replenish your energy stores and allow your damaged muscles to recover otherwise your performance will be compromised and you may experience chronic muscle soreness and pain you had to keep in mind oh, what kind of exercises do you want to do do you want to do exercises more focused in a group of muscles or do you want work component exercises what kind of workouts do you want do you want to work full body workouts or do you want work group of muscles now when you work exercises that are compound that work different group of muscles this also work like resistance you know because our complex exercise that require that your body do more effort right and also you more more calories because it's our exercises that you had to have a good equilibrium that you had to perform good form that you had to do a lot of different movements in one one time so you have to keep in mind that uh what kind of a routine do you want for example are people that don't have too much time for go to the gym that they don't have time to go to the gym so these people choose to have one or two times a uh, workout when they do full upper body if you have time to go to the gym five days a week you can easily divide the workout in group of muscles so you can work one day less one day glutes one day upper body one day core and so on so that is that you had to keep clearly in mind when you are creating a routine right also how many rests you're gonna do how many sets you're gonna do how many exercises you're gonna do some people do three some people do four sets and it depends also how how much heavy you lift and also how much reps do you do usually when people do four sets they usually uh, do reps between 8 and 12 because they are lifting heavy when you are sets between uh, like a three sets these uh, routines are more focused in heavy uh, exercises more repetition so people can do three sets but that you can do reps between for example 15 to 20 or some exercise between 20 to 30 depends what are you doing and depend also the way that are you using so all these things are important when you are going to create a routine and also are really important focus in your goals are your goals to grow muscle because if you want lots way then you have to be more focused in do 
cardio exercises between weight exercises that way you are going to burn calories and you're going to burn fat and you're going to build muscle right you also can add some kind of cardio uh, exercises uh, at the end like are you going to walk in machine and you can also uh, a stack machine in order to do some cardio and it's important that if you want more calories you can do cardio every single day at the end of your workout so you don't gonna uh, stress when you are working your routine and you are doing cardio before because then you don't have a lot of energy all these things are important to have in mind every time we are going to do certain kind of exercises you know the importance to create a routine in order to you get your goals right so the routine for today was a uh, let's routine it was more focused on less right so i also work like compound exercises i like do also hypertrophic kidney i i like also do supersets and all these kind of elements are important when you are going to create a routine so my, my workout today it was conformed for five exercises I usually start with the hardest exercises where I perform hypertrophic technique and also sometimes I meet with supersets so it's kind of like a big hard exercise now you hear all these words but you know know what it are the meaning so superset is a resistance training technique that involves performing two exercises back to back with little rest in between right so because that is a great way to maximize time in the gym but the best is that it also help to build muscle and burn calories they can also help increase aerobic intensity and combine resistance training with aerobic training so it's because also sometimes you see me performing between my exercises jumps i i do jump pros i do any kind of cardio exercise because these cardio exercises between these techniques as a hypertrophic or supersets it help us to burn calories fast our goal kind of like always is to burn calories if you want consistently burn calories the best workout that you had to do is to perform supersets hypertrophic and also cardio exercise in between your routine that is the best way to you burn calories hypertrophic technique is a, a game between the reps and the weight i usually do three sets i go for high reps to low reps but with low weight to high weight so that is the way that i perform hypertrophic technique in my exercises but also you can go backwards you can start from heavy to lower weight and go from low reps to raise your reps so there is different ways to work out but the most important thing when you create your routine is that you enjoy it that you enjoy your routine that you every time you are kind of excited to to get your goal right because you also have like a goals daily like for example a daily goal will be like you want to perform uh usually you do reps between uh 10 and 15 and then you try to do 20 right you always try to go to failure usually failure for me is kind of like rats between 25 and 30 but all this is not the same for everybody because there are people that are really strong and there are people that are not strong or there are people that like they have a lot of resistance and there are people that don't have build resistance but if you want build resistance hypertrophic to me and supersets are the best for build resistance and resistance give you like a you can last longer working out without get tired so you're gonna work harder and you're gonna get results easily and you can grow muscle fast so that is all the point to all these 
different ways to work hard i hope guys that you like this video let me know in the comments if you are curious about something specific that you want to know or that you want to do a video about thank you guys i hope that you give click to the bell don't forget give don't sub to the video and also thank you for subscribe and see you in the next video bye bye